WFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trade down now 475. We have the NASDAQ off 251. S&Ps are off 72. That's a downdraft inside the NASDAQ, folks, of 2.2%, 1.8 in the S&Ps, and 1.4 in the Dow Industrials. Gold. Gold contract uh, up $2.40, trading at 1783. You got silver down $0.05, cents, $22.36 an ounce. Light sweet crude down 247 is breaking out the lows, 74.45. Notes and bonds. You get the 10-year note. Trading up 16 ticks, 114, 12, 30 year down a full point, plus 19 ticks at 130.13. And you get the 10 year yielding 3.5 today. And King Dollar, King Dollar's rejected lower price out here. You got it up 275, trading 105, 562. Euro's 104, yen's 136, British pounds at 121 to 1 US dollar. So you're getting follow through here, folks, and we do have volume expanding. So, bottom line, now you have the S&P in the lower range. We were talking about this yesterday. Bottom line, got inside the 403, and that puts game now for the uh, SPY into that uh, 381. And right now, you're at uh, 393. We go into the NDX 100, which has been leading this baby down. Same setup, same gap it's going after. Now, the Qs, the volume's gone up big time. Yesterday, we did 41 million shares. You're already at 39. So that's going to bang out 55, 60 million. And that gap's wide open. The gap there is 268. We go to the gold contract. Now, what's intriguing here, there's no doubt. I mean, gold's pulled back, but gold and gold equities are holding up really well in this market. Uh, what you have with gold, you know, bottom line is that you're up, uh, what, two bucks out here today? I don't like the setup, I can tell you that. I mean, it's holding up, and I understand that it's holding up. Uh, but like today, you're up at 119,000 contracts, you're up 320. I wish we were down. That is not what you want to see, folks, if you're gold bull. That's not what we wanted to see because yesterday you had volume in the gold market. Bottom line here, watch this. So yesterday you go lower with 180 million, I mean 180,000 contracts, higher today with 119, not cool. And it's gonna be all about this US dollar. We finally might get a bounce out of this dollar. You had a rejection of lower price yesterday. You know, bottom line, we'll see how this shakes out. You're up 259. Uh, the higher range has to get into 106 at uh, 281, uh, which you did do, though. You, you rejected the lower price out here as well as where it went back to strength. You know, So I suspect the way this market is setting up, the dollar wants to go higher, markets want to go lower. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.